And they don't speak Estonian in Brazil anyway. Um, I just wanted to say a couple things uh, you know, to give a little more flesh to uh, you know, why we're here, why we actually chose Embraer. Uh, you know, it was a very difficult decision. Uh, a number of you were involved in some of the analysis and preparations at the end of last year, and that we had started taking a half step towards Bombardier, but then ended up turning uh, towards Embraer. Um, and I think that the, uh, the, the main reasons are those that you know, Terra has given in the past, that in the long term, uh, the Embraer plane will provide much more flexibility for us. You know, pilots certified on the small ones can fly on the larger ones. Uh, and um, you know, the one thing that I do remember is uh, when I went into my uh, first uh, uh, council meeting for Estonian Air, you know, and I'm kind of going in and there's government representatives and it's Estonia so everyone shakes really hands really formally. And um, you know, they had uh, uh, the, the, one of the, uh, one of the uh, council members asked Tero, so Tero, um, the minister went to Brussels last week. Yeah, okay, good, he normally goes to Brussels. It was raining. Sometimes it rains in Brussels. He had to walk to the jetway. I was like, well, the, the minister will not have that problem with Embraer. Uh, because at least with the Embraers, the jetway can go all the way in. Um, so, but it's a, uh, I guess, you know, from my side, we're very happy to be with the Embraers. Uh, we're happy that we have a lot more flexibility in the fleet. And probably more importantly, on the financing side, I'm happy we have a lot more financing opportunities because with Embraer, it, because it is the most uh, popular regional jet, it has something like 60% market share as opposed to 12% uh, for Embraer. Uh, you can raise money for them in a lot more different places. Uh, but in any event, enjoy the rest of the party. And I will turn a little bit over to Andreas if he's here. <laughs> Embraer on hästi välja kukkunud selle poolest, et tal on automatiseeritluse tase, mis ületab no, nii põhimõtt kui ka seda seal seid, mis meil on. Et seal on samuti võimalik teha, eks ju, kui nüüd detailidesse mine siis autolähendi ja on olemas autotrotel, mida näiteks seal seil ei olnud ja no, tehniliste poole pealt võib-olla nii ka puudutakse, et paljud võib-olla ei saa aru. Aga piloodi jaoks on ta tehtud väga mugavaks ja ilmselt on ta veel mugavam reisija jaoks. Ka minu sõgusel pikal mehel on võimalik see longis füsti liikuda, ei pea kummardama alandlikult. Pagasepanniga ei ka ta suuremad. 
ja no, ka kere on laiem, et ta tekitab sellise nagu avarama tunde või mulje. Ja ka lennuomaduste poolest, te poolest, et no, suurem lennuulatus ja, ja sellega on siis võimalik täita Stoneleri võibolla ka oma järgmist etappi või seda plaani laienemise osas. Tällega võibolla ka lõpetakse ja sooviks teile head pidu, et kes midagi täpsemalt soovib küsida lennuki kohta, palun.